hello guys it's mokube here in today's tutorial i'll be showing you guys how to import amazon product to your whole commerce site let's get into the video so guys the first thing you need to do is that you simply need to go to your chrome browser after which you click on this three dot here you go to extension after that you click on web store once you're here we are simply going to be searching for this extension called the dropship for amazon affiliate So guys, this is it here. We double tap on it. We simply click on Add to Chrome, Add Extension. So guys, we just successfully added this extension. After that, we simply click here. After that, we are going to pin this extension. Once you're done with that, you simply double tap on it. After that, you scroll down and you click on what Set up connection to store. A new pop-up is going to display so guys from here we simply need to configure this so we'll start by inserting our website url here we'll paste it here after which we we'll simply need to generate the customer key that's the client key and the execute key so i'm going to show you guys how to do that for you to get that you simply need to go to your WooCommerce site after which you click on WooCommerce once you're there you click on setting so after that you click on what advance once you get there you simply click on rest api so guys we simply need to create our api key so click on what create an api key we'll start by inserting a word our description after that for permission we are going to simply leave on we'll leave it on read and write after that you click on generate api key so guys once you are done with that you simply need to copy the customer key where you see the client key so go back here and copy the customer secret you paste it where you see the the, the secret key so for this other option here it's for the premium version so once you're done with that you simply click on what connect it is automatically going to connect your woocommerce um, plugin and the extension so once you're done with that it's going to display you the amazon official site after that we'll simply go back to our extension we'll scroll up and click on configure it from here we simply need to insert the minimum price and the maximum price so we'll start by let me just say one maximum price let me just put it like that for the increasing percentage i'll just leave it in one numbers let me just say two so after that you click on what save once you're done with that you simply need to refresh your browser so guys that's it automatically save click on for single import click here we simply need to insert your amazon affiliate id let me just say check 20, 22, 23. Yep, you scroll down, leave it like that. We'll click on what Sa save for bulk import. We we'll simply do the same thing and set Amazon affiliate ID. After which, you scroll down, you scroll down, you see category. Mm, let me just say unknown category, no problem. So after that you click on one safe bulky configuration so guys once you're done all of that you simply need to go back to your amazon affiliate site so after that we are going to be importing let me just say the redmi or xiaomi let me just say this okay since we want to import a single product we'll simply click on it a new pop-up is going to display here So after that, you simply need to click on what single import. So want to, want to simply import, but a simple product, not an affiliate product. So we are going to click on it so that we can be able to edit. We'll click here for the description. Let me just say we we'll take this one, take it. Short description. Yep. Put up description. Yep. Add gallery images to description. Mm, depend on you if you want that. So. For gallery, I'm going to say, yep, yes, 
for the reviews just leave it like that it's depending on you if you want additional information those are it so once you are done with all of that you simply click on what imports to store you need to wait for a while depending on the size of the product so guys we just successfully imported this product so we are going to verify come here click here all products so guys this is a product here you can simply edit it if you want is it you can edit the product as you can see you can edit so guys but if you want to import a um, bulky product we are simply going to go back here close this come back so we we'll simply click here after which you simply click add the first product you wait for a while you add the second product after that you add the third product so once you're done with that you simply double tap on it on this one year it's going to automatically import it to your site you need to wait for a while so guys after waiting for a while we we'll simply need to go and check on our WordPress website so guys we we'll simply scroll so guys this is it here as you can see these are the various products we are just importing thank you guys for watching don't forget to leave your comment in the comment section below if you face any difficulty doing this we love you all see you in the next tutorial peace out